Hey, welcome to today's money hack. I want to talk to you about saving money on your car repairs. Most car owners will spend about $700 a year maintaining a car, and a chunk of that comes from repairs. So check it out. I get it that not everybody's ready to change a head gasket or rebuild a transmission, but there are several repairs that are very doable. Today we're going to discuss changing your brake pads. This is one of the most popular repairs because it doesn't take long and still saves a decent amount of money. Most brake pads last about 25 to 75,000 miles, depending on what material they're made out of and how hard you press the pedal. A good place to start is by checking out some do-it-yourself auto repair YouTube videos. These YouTube videos cover a wide range of makes and models. It's a great resource and it's free. Just don't get distracted and watch a million cat videos like I do sometimes. Now, when looking for videos on YouTube, look out for two things. Number one, look at the ratings of the video. If they're good, keep watching. Number two, look at the top comments to see if other people have further input that might help you. There are a couple ways to check brake wear on disc brakes. Looking and listening. First, every now and then, you should look through the spaces between the wheel spokes. Generally, there should be at least a quarter of an inch of pad between the outer metal of the brake and the rotor. If there's less than a quarter of an inch, then you should change them. The second way of checking your brakes is easier. Do you hear a squeal every time you apply the brakes? That is likely the sound of a metal shim called an indicator. It is warning you to change the brake pads. Don't mess around if you hear the sound. If not taken care of, you will likely ruin your rotors, which will cost you a lot more to repair. So, how much will changing your own brake pads cost you? If you just replace the front brakes, the brake pads themselves will probably cost you about $30. After that, it's just the time it takes you to look up a good YouTube video and do the job itself, which takes about 30 minutes to an hour. The average front brake pad replacement at an auto shop is $150. So you'd likely save at least a cool $100 by doing the job yourself. If you feel uncertain about the process, just ask a handy friend to assist you for the first time through. Well, that's it. Just YouTube videos, brake pads, and some nice savings. Thanks for joining us on today's Money Hack.